Hello friends, this video on integrals part 44 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 43. We can do some more examples. Integral of sin root sin inverse x uh, by root sin inverse plus root cos inverse. Here also if you see, if we, even if you say this guy is pi by 2 minus x, this guy becomes cos x. And this guy is cos x sin x which remains same actually. Correct. You can add these two that becomes 1. Okay. Just by looking you can see. This guy I will write the same way. Root of sin of pi by 2 minus x by root of sin of pi by 2 minus x plus root of cos of pi by 2 minus x. Correct. And this guy is nothing but 0 to pi by 2 root of cos pi cos x by root of cos x plus root of sin x. This is also i, this is also i. So if you add these two guys, 2i is nothing but root of sin x by root of cos x plus root of sin x plus root of this guy cos x by root of cos x plus root of sin x. This is nothing if you see integral of root of sin x plus root of cos x by root of sin x plus root of cos x dx. And this guy is 1. So now what I am left with is if we let me put the upper limit and lower limit 2i is nothing but x and x values from 0 to pi by 2 because 1 dot dx is x. So what I get here is 2i is equal to pi by 2. Correct. Here also i is nothing but pi by 4. So if you see here also just by using the properties we didn't ex uh, exactly uh, found the integral of sin x or cos x. Just by using properties we found the values. Let's take one more example. See these kind of questions actually you can't solve without properties. Please pay attention to the very critical question here. Because it's mod of x plus 2 and the range is changing from minus 5 to 5. If you see mod of x plus 2 graph, this is something like this, x equal to minus 2, y becomes 0. You increase the value of x, it goes like this. You may to decrease, it goes like this. Correct? x is equal to, it breaks. If you take x equal to 0, it is 2. x is equal to, if you see, minus, if you see 4, there also it is 2. So, x is equal to minus 2 is the breaking point. Correct? So, and minus 2 is part of this guy, minus 5 to 5. So, if you see it is minus 5 to 5 up to integrate, minus 2 is part of this. So, my function is breaking. So, I can't use a single function because it's not continuous. So, as I told for integrating this, it has to be continuous, right? So, what I'll do is I'll break this guy into two functions. From here to here is continuous. From here to here also continuous. So, I'll break this guy into two function, And I know that x plus 2 mod is equal to positive x plus 2 for x is greater than minus 2 and x plus 2 mod is equal to minus of x plus 2 if my x is less than minus 2. This thing I so this guy will break from minus 5 to minus 2 mod of x plus 2 dx plus minus 2 to 5 mod of x plus 2 dx. Correct? Now if you see as I told since it is minus 5 to minus 2 this guy here the value has to be minus of x plus 2. So let's do this. So this becomes minus of x plus 2 dx plus this becomes this guy is from minus to 5 this guy is x plus 2 here this guy becomes x plus 2 dx from minus 2 to 5. Now if you see now both this integrals are continuous. Here it was not continuous, right? So we broke into two continuous integrals and now you can just solve it. So this becomes minus of, this becomes x square by 2 plus 2x from minus 5 to minus 2 plus this becomes again x square by 2 plus 2x from minus 2 to 5. There's a minus here. So if you solve this, this guy is nothing minus of minus 2 square by 2 plus 
2 into minus 2 minus this guy becomes minus 5 minus 5 square by 2 correct minus plus 2 into minus 5 this whole thing plus 5 square by 2 plus 2 into 5 minus this becomes minus 2 minus 2 square by 2 plus 2 into minus 2. So we saw that this is nothing but minus 4 by 2 that is 2 minus of 2 plus this becomes minus 4 minus 4 this becomes minus this square is plus so the minus of 25 by 2 again minus minus plus plus 10 plus this is 25 by 2 plus 2 into 5 10 minus square is plus minus 2 and this becomes minus minus plus 4. So we solve this further you get 29 and that is the answer. So the crooks part was this guy was not continuous over its over the interval. So what we did was we broke this guy into two intervals and in these two intervals from here to here this guy is continuous from here to here this guy is continuous and we found the answer. So please keep in mind these kind of questions can be tricky because it's already all already told that if you want to integrate then that in that particular interval the integrand has to be continuous. This is not a property question but I want to solve this because it's a general question we get so many uh, equation of this form x by 1 minus x to the power n and we have solved some question but this is a general form so I took this example. In this case when you have x 1 minus x or some k minus x to the power n form it is difficult to expand this so better take the whole thing as t. So you take 1 minus x as t you get minus dx as dt right and you get x is nothing but 1 minus t. So this equation turns out to be x becomes 1 minus t and 1 minus x is t dx becomes minus dt right and this guy also changes because from 0 to 1 so when x is equal to 0 all right x is equal to 0 t is equal to 1 minus 0 that is 1 when x is equal to 1 t is equal to 1 minus 1 that is 0 so it changed from 0, 0 to 1 to 1 to 0 here correct this will be t to the power n yeah now if you see this guy is simple to solve this becomes t to the power n minus t to the power n plus 1 dt correct 1 to 0 and that is nothing but t to the power n plus 1 by n plus 1 minus t to the power n plus 2 by n plus 2 from 1 to 0. So if you solve this you put 0 this becomes 0 minus 0 right 0 minus 0 minus you put 1 1 by n plus 1 minus 1 by n plus 2 is minus here so this becomes 1 by n plus 2 minus 1 by n plus 1 so if you solve this this becomes n plus 2 into n plus 1 and this you get as uh, n plus 1 minus n minus 2. So this was minus here so one, this minus I'm missing here minus here minus here so there's one more minus here this become plus and this becomes minus so minus of this that is this gone minus of this guy that is 1 by n plus 2 into n plus 1 there's minus I missed one minus here so, there's a minus here actually. This is minus of dt, right? So minus minus here, that okay. and that's minus. So this guy also will try to solve it in properties. What should we do? Not getting any clue. Let's try first thing, let's make it tan of pi by 4 minus x. Because that we can approach, just try, because we don't have any other option to do. So this becomes 0 to pi by 4 log of 1 plus tan of pi by 4 minus x just by hidden trial I am doing because I don't have any other options 
1 plus tan pi by 4 minus x if you know is nothing but tan pi by 4 minus tan x by 1 plus tan pi by 4 tan x. What is the value of tan pi by 4? 1, 1 minus tan x by 1 plus this guy becomes 1 tan pi by 4 is 1 into tan x that is tan x. So you get 1 plus tan x by 1 minus tan x. This guy is nothing but 0 to pi by 4 log of this guy is i, i is log of 1 plus 1 minus tan x by 1 plus tan x dx. Let's add these two. So this becomes 0 to pi by 2 log of 1 plus tan x minus tan x. So you get 2 by 1 plus tan x. Correct. If you observe carefully, this is nothing but 0 to pi by 2 log of 2 minus 0 to pi by 2 log of 1 plus tan x dx. You see, this guy is same as this guy. So I can write nothing but i is nothing but 0 to pi by 2 log 2 dx minus i. Correct. So this is nothing but 2i is equal to this guy. And what is the value of this? x log 2 and the value of x change from. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.